Right, let's get stuck into our next game. We'll, uh, I'd like to have a fresh squad. There's nothing worse than going 90 minutes, uh, going into extra time and thinking, oh my God, my team are knackered. Here we go, let's see who we find this time. Okay, he's got, he's got very good tech, let's be, let's be honest about it here. So, uh, Neymar, Firmino, Salah, Fernandinho. Fernandinho is one of the cards that I do want to try along with Firmino. Um, Ryan Card, I think he's an excellent centre mid. Rui Costa. It's going to be an uphill battle this game, I think. It depends how he plays. <sighs> Here we go. Side. Kevin De Gea starts in goal. Anthony Zanetti starts with Marcelo as the fullbacks. Just a pass with Lukaku. Give and go. Got power through. Power through. You don't need skills when you're that strong. Finesse. Oh, you can see what he was not a million to miles away. Well, he's in the middle there. Let's hold that up. No. Not to get it. I'll let you know. Right. Oh, I want to see Lukaku. You're on your bike. I don't want to see Vieira bombing past. Oh, what a ball. What a ball. Oh, <laughs> see, I wanted to see Lukaku take him out left and wide, open up that space for Aguero to then run through on it. didn't quite happen. You had Vieira coming through the middle instead. God knows why. Um, ah, you get there first. Oh dear. Oof, that was a let off. That was a massive let off. Hello. Favourite moves. So relaxed on the ball, Bruce Hullet. Hello. Nice return pass. It's a Guero. Hello. Romelu Lukaku. I don't really know why Lukaku was just stood at the edge of the area there. What I wanted to see was him to run into the box. Instead, I was twisting and turning with Aguero. Really, it should have been the other way around. We should have had Lukaku on the ball there, where Aguero was, and Aguero twisting and turning in the box. But Lukaku didn't really make those. Uh, doesn't really make those sort of runs. There we go. Aguero threw on his faint foot. Oh, no. Take, that, take the corner. Should be, should be finishing those. Should have perhaps squared it to Lukaku, but I had faith in Aguero. That's a poor corner. Shouldn't be up there. I was hoping to go one in, score at least one before half time. It's not going to happen now. Do we make some changes now? Probably not. He's had the better of the chances. Um, I just think perhaps we need a bit more width. So what actually what I'm going to do? I'm going to change it to a four-one-two-one-two. Not quite sure. I'm going to stick on that right hand side. I'll probably stick. Ooh. Stick my hand on about there. What's the worst that can happen? What we'll do? We'll take Pele off. Still got a bit of steel in midfield, and we'll take one of Dini on the left there. See how we get on. See how we get on. Really, we're going to have to score two now because if he then brings on a couple of subs going into extra time, would be ideal. That's what we wanted to see more of. Ah, oh, just not quite. Oh, he's almost made the cut back. Brilliant ball from Lukaku. Aguero wasn't quite there. Been through he was. Oh, lovely. We'll take that. He got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first a little bit. He's got the ball away from him with the tackle. And there's the cutback. Oh, what? They've got a perfect grip on the game now. Two 
annoying. It is annoying. I'm a bit of a sore loser, I'll be quite honest with you. I'll never rage quit, but I just don't like losing. Oh, he's almost made it three. Yeah, let's go for it. If we're off, Ronaldo won. Maguire is probably probably the best chance in the game of where I've got. Need something different. Now let's straight away. Go on. The cap will run. Oh. Okay, he wasn't challenging for it, but. Here. I've no idea where the cap was at all. Back into this, two one down. Ten minutes to go. I reckon he's probably bringing on maybe a, a defender, freshen up the back line. Um, maybe another midfielder. I can't imagine him changing his strikers now. That's the point. He's winning two one. I'm just going to try and see the game out. I think. Why is overpowered used to with all these new cards? Kaka, that's lovely. We haven't got that long to go. And the team know that. They can't get too desperate though. They need to keep some of this. Got in the way. Game over. Until they got that challenge in. Well, there we are. Final whistle. Oof. It's annoying. It is annoying. Kaku 7.3 rating. Um, I mean, it's, it speaks volumes with Maldini. You said about by far your best player on the pitch. Um, one shot on target. It's not great. It's not great. I, I can't really just blame him though because I didn't play particularly well myself. Um, the stats all sound a different, a bit of a, a, a different story, but I didn't really feel like I was uh, I was ever going to win that one. Well. We'll go into one last game. We'll see how we do. Hopefully, we'll, get a, we'll, we'll play slightly better, and, uh, and then we'll, we'll summarise what we think of uh, what we think of Lukaku. Right, who playing? Vardy, Son, Matic. Hmm. Yeah, he's got a good team. The classic Boateng, Alaba, Bali, and Valencia defence. The amount of times you see that in weekend league is unbelievable. And then uh, farm and goal. Why am I not surprised? All right, well, let's get into it. Ah. Well, we'll start well. That's a foul all day long. I do Lukaku jumping at that floor. Bali's quite strong, but Lukaku 99 strength. I think it's that that balance that's let him down a little bit there. Matches quite often referees, they don't like to book players, but this ref has no hesitation. There, I reckon. Oof, <laughs> Lukaku's jumped to try and stick his element. <laughs> oh, lovely. Magic. <laughs> what a ball from Lukaku. See, when I, when I, 
when I was first talking about Lukaku at the start, uh, that's exactly what I had in my way. He holds up the ball a little bit. Aguero finds those pockets of space in behind the defence. And Lukaku sends him through. And he's a lovely ball over the top, in all fairness. Um, Aguero's done well to finish it, but lovely bit of play. Enjoyed that. Not quite sure what happened there. Lovely, that's two. Is he off? He's queuing. I don't think he's probably wage quit. He might not, he might just be making some subs. We're waiting for this in, he's already paused it. Yeah, and he's gone. He's gone. Aguero, 10 out of 10 raising. He's cracking players like Aguero. Uh, so, Lukaku, no goals in that game. Did get the assist. Fantastic assist, and it was. It was at, the, at that as well. Um, Nice and easy win, that's what we like. Three games, sorry, three three shots, two goals. So we've played five games a weekend league now. Um, I didn't record the first couple. Um, I just wanted to get a feel for the card before we got stuck into it. Overall, I think the, the, uh, the Lukaku card, I think he's excellent. I think he's very good. Um, at times, when he's on the ball, he doesn't feel that strong. So... Um, when he's running at defenders or he's running through the midfield um, and he's dribbling with it, um, he, he, he can get pushed off the ball quite easily. Uh, in terms of the pace, the acceleration, felt good. I didn't really feel the acceleration was too much of a hindrance. I tried tried to score a couple of heading goals. He, he didn't score it in the, in the air for himself. Um, but overall, he's a, he's a very good card. Um, he set Aguero up a couple of times, five, five games, four goals, one assist, um, always involved in the gameplay. So, uh, 565,000 coins though. It's a lot of coins. It's an awful lot of coins. Um, would, I, would I buy him again? Probably. Probably. I think he offers that something a little bit different. So, I've already got Ronaldo R9 in the team. Uh, who you get, he's a big, bulky striker, but Lukaku, slightly bigger, slightly more bulky. Um, not an out and out goal scorer compared to Ronaldo R9, um, but he does the job. He does the job. So, yeah, I'd probably recommend him. I'd, uh, I'm going to keep him in my team for the time being, see how we go. Um, if I think I need to change it again, I'll, I'll let you know. But uh, that's me over and out for my first YouTube video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you'd be kind enough to give us a thumbs up with a like, that'd be lovely. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, uh, that'd be fantastic. We're going to be bringing out some more. YouTube videos. Um, I'll be getting some more editing software once I know what I'm doing on here, so I'll be slightly more slick as well. But take care, enjoy your weekend.